What's up, Molly Skyler fans? La Costa Garcia, Anaheim, California. It is hot as heck. We just flew in. Uh, we're going to be doing a corn dog contest. Annual, annual going up to the Sacramento Drive because it's hot and we like it. We like corn dogs. Killer Kennedy behind the camera. He loves sort of shoving the wieners in his mouth, so he had to come with me. We wanted to do the broken yolk, but it was a bust. Yeah, I went to the broken yolk, but they don't carry chili, so whatever. We'll find another one. We're cool with that. Uh, King Ranch Burrito. Uh, basically, it's a five pound burrito with just meat. It just is described as meats, veggies, and lots of guacamole. Yeah, it is a pay for play. $18. Uh, unfortunately, I think that's probably a pre COVID price. But that's all right. We'll still pay for it. Um, I mean, if it costs 20, 30 bucks, that's cool. I'll pay for a burrito. Uh, yeah, that's about all I got to say. I like burritos. So does Killer Kennedy. On um, woman versus food. Let's get her eat on. Massive burrito came out. Massive. Massive. Check that out. That's huge. I'm trying to like burn my arm here. Uh, sour cream, guacamole, melt the cheese, all of them. We got the ground beef. Um, if you want to do an upcharge, you can do it if you want to add different meats to it, which is totally possible. Pork, chicken. Um, but we just did the ground beef. Uh, $26. So it did go up. Uh, there's actually no time limit on it because you're buying it no matter what. You got to pay for it. So it's a pay for play, true pay for play with no time limit. So we're just going to honestly casually enjoy this and heck yeah, man. All right. Eat burritos. All right. We're going to eat. Three, two, one. Three, two, one. King Ranch burritos. King Ranch burritos. I'm just going to pull this thing up and see what it looks like. Yeah. Oh, it's stuff. Look at that. Look at that, Andy Boo. Your favorite rebred beans. Massive. Yeah, good. Really good. I wish it was spicy. Stop it. Kennedy does not like spicy foods. I about died last time we did one. Oh god, that burrito was We did one in orange and I about died. You just hadn't been put your big girl pants on yet. Mm. In all honesty, that one was actually uh, Guajilos. That was. It was a burrito. I think it was hot. Yeah, it was. We should start just doing live. Yeah. Should have ordered two of these. Yeah. I didn't want to pay for it. That's my problem. This is going to be a burrito that I actually eat completely with a pork. That's part of the challenge you have to eat with a pork. Mm -hmm. Yeah, from all these guys. I don't think I've done a burrito with just a fork before. Ah, maybe I have. I can taste the beefiness. The last time I was in California, maybe at 15 pounds. I think it was huge. I think it was 18 something. I did that one in like 2014, 2015. It was big. It was truly a beast. That was in my bandana days. It was every bit of 15 pounds. Yeah, it was. This is almost spoon worthy. It's good though, it's really good. You do have to buy it all, but not man. Hmm? Not a fan of my phone. So you as a franchisee rent lease the land up on McDonald's. Well, I don't ever plan on owning McDonald's, so. Good. Okay. Hmm? 
mean, they have some good stuff there, but I don't, I don't generally eat those food, so. It, I don't know. You put Chick fil A in food first. Uh -huh. A Chick fil A. Yeah, that's what's called. This is a, it's like, taco, it's like a taco salad. It looks big. Comment below. Should I eat burritos with my fork or should I use my hands? Because this would have been done like five minutes ago. It's good though. It is big though. It's every bit of five pounds. Well, if you were to buy this as a meal and split it between people, it's totally worth it. like four people's meals. Four people. The four people meal deal. Yeah. The four people meal deal. The four people meal deal. The deal of a lifetime. <laughs> Cleanest you'll ever see me eat a burrito. Yeah? <laughs> She's still making a mess. You want to pick up that lettuce chunk on your plate? Yep, sure will. There you go. That fry she never ate at Highway 55 about five years ago? One fry. Still not done with that burger can. Remember that mac and cheese that you gave your dog? It didn't count. Yep. Definitely need bigger forks. I can't get food on the fork. <laughs> Can you have a spoon with you? Mmm, I might. It's like casual Thursday. Yeah. Things throwing me off here. Very good burrito. Delicious. You use your hand for the last scoop, make it go at home? No, because then that I would be going against what I said I would do. Believe it or not, I was brought up to use utensils eating my food. <coughs> I just <laughs> could have fooled us. I don't know. I do too if it was free. Seriously awesome burrito. It actually kind of reminds me of a like classic taco salad without the chips underneath it. It's really good. Um, zero complaints. That was fabulous. Um, yeah, I know I ate it with the fork. I was going against the grain there, trying to be a 
cultured and such. Premium so, Robert. I know. I don't do it very often, but sometimes I have to prove that I can do it, and I'm just like casual Thursday, I guess. But yeah, if you ever want to come out and grab a uh, massive five-pound burrito, I mean, like you said, it's 26, 28 bucks. Like that. Mm. You know, split between a couple people and have yourself a good time. Because really, if you if four people, three, four people, I mean, really, you're paying five, six bucks. A burrito, six bucks a piece. Cheap. Not bad. So, seven bucks. Um, yeah, I would definitely come back. I would definitely do another one if I had to pay for it. But definitely worth the $26, $28 that we're spending for it. And King Ranch Burrito, man. Delicious. I give it A plus. Oh, wow. Yeah. Yum. <laughs> <laughs> like and subscribe. Check out Kennedy's channel. We'll see you next time.